Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's that time of year again. The cult known as Apple, made in California. Someone got hungry and took a bite out of it. It's here again to spread diseases onto us. If you didn't know, around September, they decide that it's time to click Control C, click Control V in their warehouse and print off another iPhone and add a number one to it. So I think it's like the iPhone three billionth and first. If you're anything like me, I've got an iPhone uh, a six or a seven or something. It's still got a home button. It still works brilliantly. It lasts about 30 minutes, but I don't go on it enough for it to ever run out, so it's fantastic. It takes pictures, it saves pictures, it sends text, it gets text. It sends calls, it receives calls. It plays Subway Surfers, and it plays Clash of Clans. I need nothing else on my phone. This is a be thing of beauty. It should deserves to be in a museum once I've done with it, and I, I, I intend to volunteer it off. I intend to give it to the people who deserve it. But I tell you what I think I deserve. I deserve to take the piss. Apple is a cult, and you get these people who are there and queuing up on day one and waiting outside camping just to get a phone that is exactly the same. I saw something on Twitter, and I don't know if it's true, that you can play Assassin's Creed Mirage on the new iPhone. Now, I think that's a load of baloney, haloney, day faloney, because that shit can't be real. I'd struggle to believe it. If you can play Assassin's Creed Mirage on an iPhone, I don't want to play it on my PlayStation, because why have you made it like that? It should, you know, an iPhone's an iPhone. An iPhone's an iPhone, man. It's a cult following. They're bringing out VR, obviously they're bringing out an Apple Watch stuff, and today I just wanted to, uh, you know, take the PI stake, have a little bit of a giggle, have a bit of a laugh, take the mick out of all these freaks who go and queue outside for an Apple product just to realise, ah oh, shit, it's the same, it's the same damn thing. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. What the fuck's going on? As far as it, it's one hour twenty-five. Oh, so they're trying to bring tragedy into this and show that an iPhone and an Apple product can save your life. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine she just goes on a run and gets a, heart, a high heart rate and then, you know, she leaves it to a tumor. Like, fuck me. About two essential products, Apple Watch and iPhone. This guy's so animated, isn't he? He's, like, so old but trying to move at the same time. And you're, like, seeing what he's doing with his hands. He's, like, trying to be a cheerleader, but he's, like, not really, um, you know, he's not very mobile, not very effective. Help Save lives. lives. Help him save lives. Apple Watch is the world's most popular watch. And Series 9 takes it to the next level. Series 9 of an Apple Watch. I remember when the first one came out. Like, what else more can you do with a watch? It tells the time. Tells you your heart rate. Tells you how fast you're running. Where you're running to. Tells you your text message. What more do you need? Here's Deidre to tell you all about it. Go on, Deidre. Like advanced workout metrics, sleep stages, and car crash detection. <laughs> Imagine that! It looks like you've been in a car crash. <laughs> you know, if you're in a serious car crash, I don't think you're going to be looking. Oh, I am actually. Thank you for noticing. I've just gone straight through my windscreen. Like, what? What good is that going to be? That enables precision finding for iPhones with the same chip. You'll see both the distance and direction to your iPhone. See, that's really, actually, uh, you know what, I'll, I'll actually give them that. I'm not going to spend £6 billion on a watch that I won't use. However, I lose my phone on a daily. If it could give me, like, how many centimetres away it is from me, that would be fantastic. Imagine that, you're like, you can't find it. You've just woken up, you're like, oh my god, where is it? It is 0 0.5 metres away. Oh my god, it's right there. Ultra has helped people accomplish extraordinary feats. Like summiting the tallest mountains, completing demanding endurance races, and diving the world's oceans. What a load of shit is that, mate? What a load of BS is that? Your watch doesn't help you do it, it just sort of records you doing it. You could do it, probably with more wrist mobility, if you didn't have the watch on. How can you say, we've helped people do this, that, and the other? You've done sweet FA, mate, to affect it. You've just allowed them to record how long it takes them, and, you know, their heart rate when they get to top of Mount Everest and decide they're having a heart attack because it's too high up. Giving our users a device that's incredibly powerful Powerful, remarkably easy to use, and beautifully designed. <laughs> the fucking hand gestures, what's he doing? Beautifully designed, incredibly smooth, and a real thick back. 6.1 inches for iPhone 15 and 6.7 inches for iPhone 15 Plus. The larger display of iPhone 15 Plus gives you more space for text when you're reading the latest article, post, or message. No way, a bigger phone means you get more on the screen. Who would have thought it? 
Thank you so much, lady, for explaining to me what a larger screen does. I, I feel like a new man. We're using 100% recycled cobalt in the battery and 100% recycled copper foil in the main logic board and MagSafe charger. Do you think people are actually watching this and like getting, you know, like yeah, you see in like the American cinemas and like something pops up on the screen and people start standing up and cheering like, Woo, yeah, go you! Oh my God, a new camera! No way! A recycled cobalt shit! Oh my god, a new battery you taking them! Oh my god! I'm gonna cream my knickers! <sighs> oh, look at them textures, mate! Fuck me! You know what I'm actually so look at that bad boy, the the HDR, the 40, 144 hertz, mate, it looks fucking like insane now. What the fuck? This chip also opens up a completely new way to use precision finding on iPhone 15. Just imagine being like the extras on this, right? Right, guys, just pretend you're in a market, pretend you're buying. It's like, oh, yeah, look at this. Oh, yeah. It's like, all right, we, we can't pay today, but here's like an iPhone 7. We're uh, recycled. So here you go, guys. Yep, thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Hi, Tim. You simply press and hold the button to confirm your intent. You also feel a distinctive haptic feedback for each state. And you can choose from a set of actions and easily... See, that's quite cool, to be fair. If you could turn your torch on by just, like, tapping a button and shit like that, that would be pretty good. Or, like, going to a camera, I, you know, I'll give them that. Out of this, you know, an hour and two minutes, they have finally done one thing that is worth it. Well done. But it's only on the more expensive iPhone, don't forget that, because they don't care about the poor people on the poor shit. Fucking scum. Oh, my God, you can play Genshin Impact! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! This is by far our best iPhone lineup ever. With dynamic island across the iPhone 15 lineup, incredible new camera systems, and... It's just the same shit. It's the same shit, but a hundred quid more each time. It's like a joke. Who's going to buy this? And there's so many of them. Thank you for joining us. Have a great day. I lost Tim, or whatever your name is. No comments. But as all great, all great people, let's go, let's go to, uh, let's go to Twitter. What, what is there? Yeah, so you change that, you see all that shit. You can like the thing, you can like the thing. Uh, yeah, they're changing the cable, but like, who gives a fuck? Yeah, as long as it fits in my phone. I think they, see, that's what I mean, they're all the fucking same. They're all the same. Oh, uh, yeah, see, if you actually care, go ask Mark, ask Brownlee's video. Well, look, what do you think? I don't care. I've, like I said, my phone's a piece of shit. You let let me know. See you later, guys, and thank you so much. iPhone's a cult. Don't forget that. Don't join it.